Welcome to my PS4 pickups for the month of May 2017. Quite a few games to go through, so let's start. First of all, I've got two Dark Limited Edition by Big Ben. Uh, yeah, I don't know much about this indie title. Um, the Limited Edition comes with an art book and a steel case, as you can see there on the back. It's dark, disturbing and dirty, IGN. Yeah, I'm looking forward to giving uh, this game a go. I haven't seen any gameplay or checked anything out on the internet about this game. It was quite cheap. Uh, it does have a steelbook, so that draw me to, to purchasing that game. Next up, uh, Tectomancer. Game is still sealed, so I haven't played this. It seems to me it's a sci-fi RPG. I don't know much about this one as well. Uh, what will soon, I will give it a go and check what it's about. That's Technomancer. Next up, we've got an online game. It's Overwatch Origins Edition. Uh, Overwatch brought to you by Blizzard. Yeah, heard good things about this game. Um, I'm going as a newbie into this, so I haven't played Overwatch at all. So I will most probably get my ass kicked on the multiplayer. But you have to start somewhere. And I will start up, give it a go, and check how I can progress to rank up in that game. Next up, new. Now it's made by Team Ninja. It's a it's sort of like Dark Souls Bloodborne games it's quite difficult for me it's better than the Soul series in my opinion it's more fluent than the Dark Souls games the combat is also better um, for me uh, I haven't played that much of this game but I did and what I what I played I enjoyed Graphics is, is great, it's PS4 Pro enhanced, so yeah, if you're looking for a game like Dark Souls Bloodborne, I do recommend picking up new. Next up we've got a PS4 exclusive, that is Persona 5 by Atlas, that's a JRPG, uh, played I think 4-5 to five hours of this, what I've played it's quite good. It seems to me it's one of those games that you can spend hundreds of hours and and not complete the game. It's one of those games that you can continue on going, going, going on. But yeah, the game seems to be quite good. I don't have any complaints as of yet. Next, uh, it's another indie title. This is The Police by THQ Nordic. Basically what this is, is you're a police chief on retirement. Um, yeah, and it's your duty to, to bring the police force up to par. Uh, make, a, make a good impression on the, the civilians staying in, in your city. I have played, I think, an hour or two of this. It's a, it's a lot of strategy in, in the game. Yeah, it's not bad for what it is next up uh, my first call of duty game in my my next gen collection it's the legacy edition call of duty infinite warfare and call of duty modern warfare remastered by activision yeah uh, i was surprised pleasantly surprised by the campaign of call of duty infinite warfare um, even though it's in space and space suits and all that shit, um, the game, the campaign wasn't that bad. Um, the story was good, yeah. And of course, um, Call of Duty Modern Warfare uh, story campaign is amazing. I do not like the multiplayer in Call of Duty Infinite Warfare. I do not play that at all. Do not like, like I said, the space suits, the jumping suits, whatever you call that. Um, I do play a lot of the, the Modern Warfare uh, multiplayer. I do like that. Yeah, so that is Call of Duty. It's, um, it's a good game. 
and yeah call of duty world war ii coming to us november looking forward to that um next up we've got another indie title stardew valley collector's edition by 505 games basically you inherited a farm from your grandfather now you have to build up the farm produce um, produce things grow things build things yeah, it's a simulation type game uh, yeah you're a farmer so basically not much more i can say about that did play a couple of hours of that not too bad at all next up um tom glancy's uh, ghost recon wildlands the deluxe edition the deluxe edition comes with a map and a soundtrack uh, it's by ubisoft also not a bad game at all it's a lot like the the division game just much better than that yeah that put a uh, quite a few hours into that game do you enjoy that but yeah it does come become a bit repetitive at times because at times it seems that you're doing the same uh, same thing over and over again but yeah other than that uh, no complaints for for that game then lastly we have an older type type oh, sorry older title it's uh wolfenstein the old blood by bethesda machine gun games um i think this is a prequel prequel to the new order wolfenstein a new order um yeah almost like a dlc uh, but in, in physical form yeah it's good shooter great shooting mechanics not a bad game at all did enjoy that did complete that takes five six hours to complete so yeah there you have it that's the the ps4 pickups for the month of may 2017 yeah my backlog is growing at a rapid pace but um what i'm basically doing at this stage now i'm picking up all the older games that i picked up i'm picking that up and playing that completing that now so i'm working through games like assassin's creed black flag things like that trying to complete that uh, so yeah i can i can start doing the, the, the newer titles that comes out quite a few new releases that comes out e3 still on its way looking forward to that so yeah i don't think i'll pick up a lot of games in june and july maybe about august september i'll pick up a few a few again but i will start on my channel again uh, uploading uh, gameplay videos and so forth i didn't have the time uh, in recent months to do that but i will start doing that again so yeah um, i'm looking forward to posting new videos so yeah if you like this video please comment if you want to say something if you want to um, give feedback on these games or games that you think i should pick up if you like it press that like button and yeah subscribe if you want to you don't have to thank you and thank you for watching and then i will see you soon